Question number 21, part A. Solve for x. So we are given 4x, 4 minus x, x minus 4 into bracket squared is equals to x minus 8 into bracket 2x plus 7 into bracket. So to be able to solve for x, we need to expand this. So we write this is x minus 4, close the bracket, and x minus 4. We can expand this x multiplied by 2x, that will give us 2x squared. Uh, x uh, multiplied by 7, that is 7x, minus 8 multiplied by my, my 2x, that is 16x. Uh, minus 8 multiplied by 7, you get minus 56. So you expand this, you get x multiplied by x, you get x squared. Uh, minus x multiplied by minus 4, that is minus 4x. And x four, minus 4x multiplied by x minus 4x, so that add up to minus 8x uh, plus 16 is equals to uh, this you can really write is 2x squared. Uh, this is minus, this will give you 7x minus 16. That will give you minus 9x minus 56. So you bring this side to the, the, the this side, everything on this side to the other side. Uh, so you have uh, this, my x squared will be minus. So 2x squared minus x, that will give us x squared. 8x minus 8x will become positive. Uh, so it is minus 9x plus 8, that will give us a minus x. Uh, 16 will become minus, so this will give us minus 72 is equal to 0. You can factorize this. Uh, so you get two numbers such that when you multiply them, you get minus 72. When you add them, you get... Uh, minus 1. So this is x squared. The numbers are minus 9 and 8. Uh, so plus 8x uh, minus 72 is equal to 0. You can factorize here. You say x minus 9 and this is plus 8x minus 9 is equal to 0. Uh, this will give us x minus 9 and we have x plus 8 is equal to 0. So this means that we cannot be able to get the value of x. x is equal to either 9 or uh, or minus 8. So that those are the values that satisfies our equation. Part 2, we are told John cycled 6 kilometers from his home to school at an average speed of uh, 2x minus 3 kilometers per hour. Peter walked 2.4 kilometers from home to, to the school at an average speed of x kilometers per hour. Peter took 16 minutes less than John. Determine the time in minutes that John took to reach uh, the school. So time, uh, time taken by John, which is 16 minutes uh, more than what Peter took, uh, or Peter took uh, 16 minutes less, so we take distance 6 divided by uh, the, the speed which is 2x minus 3 minus time taken by Peter uh, which is uh, 2.4 you divide by the speed which is x it should be equals to 16 minutes which Peter took so you write 16 but you divide by 60 so that uh, you convert to hour. So you cross multiply. Here we have 6x uh, minus uh, 2.4. You multiply by 2x minus 3. All this is, uh, we have that, can put that. All that is divided by uh, 2x minus 3 and uh, 2x minus 3 and you multiply by x is equals to his. this you can simplify by 4 you get 4 by 4 is 15 so it is 4 over 15 then cross multiply again uh, you can say this is a uh, 6x minus this is 4.8x and this will be positive uh, this is plus 7.2 7.2 
uh, which you now you can now exp uh, cross multiply you multiply by 15 is equals to uh, 4 when you open the bracket here this is 2x squared minus 3x uh, so what you do here is you sub 6x minus 4.8 uh, you'll be able to get 1.2x you multiply by 15 you get 15x uh, then the other one uh, not 15 but 18x uh, minus uh, this is a uh, this is a uh, you get uh, you multiply this by 7.2 7 by 15 you get uh, this will be give you plus 108 is equals to when you open the bracket here 8x squared uh, minus uh, the other one is 12x so we we'll bring everything to, uh, to this side so this will be 8x squared uh, this is a uh, 18x you take it to the other side uh, becomes a uh, minus so it will be uh, minus 30x uh, then you have uh, 108 becomes minus so 108 uh, there you get it is equals to 0 so this is a quadratic equation uh, which I don't know whether we can be able to simplify or we can we can just use a quadratic formula and say x is equals to uh, let's simplify here and uh, maybe it will not give us a lot of problems so we divide by we divide by let's divide by 2 divide by 2 divide by 2 uh, this means that uh, we have 4x squared uh, 4x squared let's use a different color uh, this will give us a uh, 4x squared uh, this is a uh, minus 15x and the other one will be minus 54 is equals to 0 I uh, don't know whether I can just use a quadratic formula it is minus minus 15 so that becomes positive 15 positive 15 uh, plus or minus the square root of minus 15 squared uh, minus 4 a is 4 c is 54 minus 54 so this changes to positive and we put there uh, 2 at ply by 4 so this will give us uh, when you compute this it is 15 uh, plus or minus 33 that is 225 that will be positive you compute that uh, all this is divided by 8 so this means uh, this means that uh, 15 plus 33 uh, divided by 8 or this is 8 here or 15 minus 33 divided by 8 so this is equals to uh, this is 48 48 divided by 8 that will give us 6 or uh, minus this is minus uh, this is minus uh, that will give us 33 that will give us 18 divided by 8 that will give us 2.25 minus but because we are talking of time then what we do is that we ignore that one so we say x is equal to 6 because x is equal to 6 then and time uh, John took uh, 2x minus 3 that was uh, the time uh, no this is the speed uh, then we can uh, let me get some space here to complete that uh, just create a space here so if we take x uh, John took uh, 6 divided by 6 divided by 2 multiply by uh, 6 and then you uh, this have said here minus 3 so this is equals to uh, what you get you multiply by 60 because these are minutes so when you compute that you'll be able to get that will give you uh, 40 minutes that, that, that these are hours uh, then you have to convert to minutes 
so because uh, this is given in kilometers per hour so that is the answer to that question and you get yourself six marks totaling to 10 marks so time taken by uh, we are time taken by john is six divided by two x minus three where we have found our x is is equal to six so when you substitute here and you convert to these are hours you convert to minutes you should be able to get 40 minutes that is the time taken by john to reach the school